When are you getting married? Ni <laughs> Lester. <laughs> Sagot. Hello! Hello! Hello, friends! Hello, friends, and welcome to uh, the vlog once again. My name is Joy Spring. I'm Juancho Trevino. And you are? The boyfriend. The boyfriend. <laughs> And uh, back by popular demand dahil hinihingi ng mga tao ang uh, pagbabalik ni Wancho dito sa vlog. So ngayon, uh, sasagot kami ng mga questions nyo about... You don't invite me. Hey, you're invited now. Sorry na. Look at us! We're so cute! Anywho, ito na nga guys, mga ka-guys. Mag-answer na tayo ng mga questions nyo on Instagram. Dahil trinay namin itong gawin one time, kaso nalubat yung camera ko. So, it was a fail. Please don't forget to use our official hashtag, hashtag one choice. <laughs> My one and only choice. Okay, mag-question na tayo. Our first question for today ay, this is from Dimple Apolinar. Sabi niya, hello po, one choice. Wow, isang unit na talaga tayo. Ngayong mag-boyfriend-girlfriend na po kayo, ano po yung mga na-discover niyo sa isa't isa? God bless. Sige nga, one choice, anong na-discover mo? Ladies first. Uh, na-discover ko kay Wancho. Hindi na siya naliligo as much ngayon. Uy! Oh, bakit? Tama, tama naman. <laughs> <laughs> Medyo... <laughs> Naging kampante na. Sobrang <laughs> kampante. <laughs> okay na yan. Dumating na Tanggap sa... niya na ako. Sabi, oh, sabi, sinagot na, na ako. Hindi na ako maliligo. Oh. Dumating na sa point na hindi na naliligo si Wancho. Save Dat... water kasi. Oo. Oh. Dati kasi mga twice or thrice a day. As in talagang uuwi pa siya. Pabango. Oo, oh, oh, pabango. Plus. Plus. Everything. Nagagargle pa yun. Alam mo yung first few months namin sa unang hirit. Every time na I arrive. Bago niya ako harapin, nakikita ko siya, nagagargle siya. As in, out of the van, magagargle siya before he says hi to me. Ngayon, wala. Wala na, kahit tulo-laway, no? Tulo-laway. As in, tasabihin niya pa sa akin, oh, daming tulo ng laway ko ngayon, na sa unan niya, sa unang hirin. Well, ako naman, ang na-discover ko kay Joyce. <laughs> Pinaka-importanting na-discover ko sa iyo ay compatible tayo. Ano ba yan? Kahit hindi kami... Kahit... Ma-compatible kami, okay. At saka mas magaling ako magluto sa kanya. Totoo. Uwe. Oh, bakit? Mas madalas siya magluto. Next question. Okay, okay. Sige, alam ko na ang uh, ano? na-discover okay, ko kay Joyce. One. Ano na-discover mo ay? Maalaga si Joyce ng sobra. Hindi oh. mo ba alam yun? Ah, sa bagay, oh. Sinusungitan pa kita nung iba tayo. Uh, well, kahit naman ngayon, sinusungitan mo pa rin naman ako. It's a, it's a roller coaster of an emotion. You know, it's an adventure being with me. You never know what you're gonna get every morning. Ito, ibang klaseng adventure to. Maliban sa unang hirit, maliban sa mga dates namin, mga surprises. This is another uh, aspect of an adventure with you. Oo na, o basta. O sige, so maalaga daw ako. Next! When are you getting married? Ni <laughs> Lester. <laughs> Ang question ni D. Lester, when are we getting married? Sagot. At the right time. Si cute underscore Isabella, favorite place nyo po in the Philippines. What's our favorite place to get? Actually, you know, we've never actually traveled together na kaming dalawa lang. The, that's not for work. Yeah. So, wala pa kami. Well, siguro. Siguro yung mga napuntahan natin A ako, sa unang hirit. May mga memories tayo para sa akin is Tagaytay. Ay, oo nga, Tagaytay. Marami tayong memories doon. Marami naganap doon na uh, kilig moments. Doon ba tayo time. nagsagutan? Doon ata. Doon naman na-realize na hindi lang pala ito, ano? Oh, first I love you. Yan, yeah, yung mga first I love you. Tagaytay. Tagaytay. That's nice. Yeah, and yung surprise mo sa akin nung Valentine's Tagaytay. was also in Tagaytay. Next, ano daw yung night routine natin as a couple? Wala kayo masyadong night routine as a couple kasi uwi na by mga 6pm. <laughs> 7. Nang, oh, 7 or 6, tapos na kami. But I think one of the routines that we would usually, the one thing that we always do is we call before we sleep. Yeah. Um, or minsan pag hindi super maaga yung call time, we fall asleep on the phone. So, nagpa-facetime kami. Or no facetime Papakita namin yung screen cap dito. Wow! wow. Look at that! Oh, Look galing, how clean diba? we are. Yes. As if hindi tayo magkasang buong araw. Uh -oh. So, that's one routine that we have as a couple. Next, Hyper Girls asks, Sino po ang mas clean? One, two, three, one, two. Joyce. Huh? Ganito na naman. Sino yung totoo? Okay, fine. Ako! Explain mo sa kanila bakit ikaw yung mas clingy. 
mas kaling niya ko dahil ganon siguro talaga yung personality ko. I'm really dependent on other people. Gusto ko palagi ako nakadikit. On other people ba? Or just, and, just me? Just, well, you, my family, my friends. Ganun talaga ako klaseng tao. Pero lalo na kay Joyce. Nako, lagi kong gusto nakadikit ako. As in, nababadrip talaga ako pag hindi ako nakaholding yan sa kanya. Di ba? Alam mo yun, di ba? Yes. Ayan, dapat nakaganito ako palagi sa kanya kapag magkasama kami. Pag hindi ako nakaganyan sa kanya, naiinis ako. Love, what are you doing? Yeah. Mind me, mind me. Mind me, please. So, mas klingi talaga si Wancho. Sino ba sa inyo ang mas klingi ang mga boyfriend? Girlfriends or boyfriend? Josh Mosby says, Bro, kailan ka magpo-propose kay Joyce? You have the chance of a lifetime with JP. Go. O, kailan daw? I'd rather not say. Bakit? Because it's a secret. If I share it. So, you are gonna propose? Of course I am. Ganun ko naman talaga papunta lahat ng... Relationships, di ba dapat? Dapat. Okay. Next question. Engineer Esmail asks, What do you love the most about your partner? Yan na! Favorite three. The thing that I love most about Moncho is that he's a very kind-hearted, gentleman person. Never siya naging bastos or anything like that. And he's very compassionate. Lagi niyang inuunay ako. So, kung kakain, kung... Papasok sa isang lugar, taking care of me. He's always putting me first before himself, and I think that's what I love most about him. The thing I like most about like talaga one show. The thing I love most about you is you know your priorities. Kampante ako na iko yung partner ko. Sure, in the long run, lalo na you know how to handle your time well. You know how to handle time with people. You know how to handle your uh, finances also. Eh, hindi ako magaling sa pera. So, uh, that's one thing that, uh, you know, you can handle our finances in the future. Wow. Mas responsable talaga si Joyce. Mas hardworking lang. Kapulo. Hindi, joke lang. Parehas naman kami hardworking. The next question is actually related to what you just said, my love. Ang tanong ni Doc Philip ay, Best advice you can give to couples like you who are both career-oriented yet so much in love? That's a great question, Doc Philip. Are you an actual doctor? Probably. Uh, it may sound cliche, pero nasa tamang pag-balance lang talaga yan. So, paano mga binabalance sa mga bagay-bagay? Unang-una, kailangan syempre unahin mo yung priorities mo. Uh, know your priorities. Number one. Know where you stand. Number two, where you stand. Dapat alam mo kung anong gusto mo. Dapat alam mo kung saan ka papunta. Hindi yung paligoy-ligoy ka. Naiintindihan ko naman yung mga obstacles along the way. Pero syempre, kailangan you know your priorities and you stick to them. Okay, that's Tapos, uh, kailangan syempre guided by the right values. Ako, feeling ko, when it comes to couples, when you're both career-oriented but so much in love, you have to have the same end goal. As in, if you both have that conversation na, okay, ang end goal natin ay mag-asawa mag tayo, we build a family, but we have to at least a lot, bawa, two years na magkakarir lang tayo and we help each other yeah. out. It's easier for you to make adjustments that would be difficult if you didn't know what your end goal was as a unit. As in, you really have to operate as a unit. Kami ni Wancho may mga days na siya yung tumutulong sa akin. So, siya yung mag adjust sa samahan niya ako sa event, tutulungan niya ako. And then, there are also days where I'm the one naman that's the support system for Wancho. Hindi pwedeng isa lang palagi yung susupport or isa lang palagi yung bida sa relationship niyo or isa lang palagi yung ipofocus. There always has to be like a mutual understanding of where you stand as a couple. Give and take. Give and take din talaga siya. And yun nga, dapat parehas kayo ng goal, parehas kayo ng values. And more importantly, I think you both have to be guided by God. Kasi, kung yung stand Standards nyo just on your own. You will always like argue and fight. But if you understand how God designed relationships to be and how you both are supposed to love and take care of one another and prioritize each other before your own self, mas madaling maging uh, successful both in your careers and your relationships. Okay, mga bagay. What she said. Whoa, Madeline Bo asks, how did you know that she was the one? How did you know that How she was the one? How did you the know one? that I was the one God gave for your life? <laughs> I just made that right now. Nung nag-unang mga nagkakasama pa lang kami ni Joyce, I really felt comfortable with her. 
Masaya siya kasama. Wow. Ayun. Pangalawa, she gets along with my family and friends very well. From the very beginning up until now, love na love siya ng mga pamilya ko at ng mga kaibigan ko. Number three, she makes me a better person. Spiritually, emotionally. Maganda yung support na binibigay ni Joy sa akin. Mapa sa school, mapa sa career, mapa sa spiritual life ko. So it all works out really well. Nagahihilahan kami pataas. So that's when I knew that she was the one. Oh, tagal na na. Ang dami standards ha. Okay. Sino mas mabilis mag-sell us from day and out? One, two, three. Hindi na ako natanggi niya. Alright! Nagbabalik na tayo mga guys dito sa aking channel. Actually, dapat hindi ko pala in-intro dahil ito lang yung uh, continuation ng vlog na hindi namin natapos. So, tatapusin lang natin siya dahil meron pang a couple of questions na pwede nating sagutin. From ENCBRN. Hindi ko alam. Paano po ma-maintain yung sweetness and kilig moments kahit everyday kayo magkasama? Paano nga ba? Well, always look for something new to do. Pero, ang mas importante ang uh, it always has to come from the heart. And okay. kailangan parang you'll always, you know, try to make you uh, make her happy like what I do. I always try to make you happy. Kahit sa mga maliliit na bagay, small efforts like, you know, long texts or uh, surprising me. Surprises. Yeah, tiny surprises. Tiny naman. surprises, oh. Na may maintain yung kilig that way. Well, kami naman ni Joyce. Araw-araw kami magkasama, pero hindi naman tayo nauubusan ng uh, kilig moment. Wow, talaga ba? Except pag nag-aaway kami, yun talagang walang kilig. <laughs> Medyo may kilig siya. Diba? Ibang klaseng kilig. Ibang klaseng stress na kilig. Ako naman feeling ko, for you guys to uh, stay sweet and kilig to one another, kailangan may certain level of individuality na dapat ma-maintain nyo. So, we always have our own thing going on. Diba? Kasi mga siya has his basketball games, he has his gym workouts, ganyan, mga workshops niya for acting. Ako naman, I always have something that I'm doing on my own. So, because of that, parang feeling ko, we get to maintain who we are and then also, meron kaming kinagkwento sa isa't isa, di ba? Yeah, that's a really good point. Hindi kayo pwede maging dependent sa isa't isa. Mm -hmm. At mahirap nang palagi kayong nag expect sa partner nyo na dapat may ginagawa ka na. Dapat, uh, uh, kasi, di ba, you mm -hmm. have to make me happy. Yeah. Kailangan, katulad ng sinabi ni Joyce, you have to have something that you do on your own, syempre, to make it more exciting all the time. And, alam mo, Dapat talaga. Yun kasi I think the the usual problem that couples have to deal with is pag they depend on each other for happiness. As in, ikaw yung kasayahan ko. You're the reason why I'm happy. As Aaron and I once said, you shouldn't be with someone that makes you whole. You should be with someone that makes you a whole lot better. Ah, heart, heart. And honestly, also, no, no human being can make you happy. Only God can give you that kind of joy that never changes. What other people or the people that you love can bring you is happiness because they add to your life. They shouldn't be completing it. Yeah. Diba? Yung you complete me. Eh, pag you complete me, tas bigla siyang nawala, diba? Di, hindi ka na ulit complete. No, Dapat saka, complete ka bago ka mag-relationship. Yep, that's true. Okay. Sabi ni It's underscore Miss Orozco. How's the feeling of being in love? Explain. Yeah. How's the feeling of being in love? What's the feeling of being in love, ka, Baba? Ano, every time I see you. Wait, here's a better question. When did you find out or how did you know that you were in love with me? Oh. I can't stop thinking about you. I'm going to go back. I always call you. Kahit hanggang ngayon eh, palagi akong super duper clingy sa'yo. I'm just so happy when I'm uh, with you. I'm just really always looking forward sa mga araw natin sa unang hirit, where we go after, yeah. uh, or what to do. I, I'm, I was always excited to learn something new about you, whether it would be positive or negative. Ayun. Ganda. Ganda. Ang ganda. Ang ganda. Wow. wow. Okay, so I think uh, that's pretty much it for this episode of Get to Know Us Better with One Choice. Thank you for all of your questions, guys. Uh, sa uulitin, may message ka ba sa ating mga ka-friends, One Choice? Yeah, I haven't uh, been vlogging recently. May pinaghahandaan kasi akong show. Hashtag Artista Life. Pero I'll be back soon with another season of 
Ano? Manchas Vlogs. With, of course, my baby Joy. Wow. Okay. So, in the meantime, subscribe to his channel, Wancho Trivino. Yeah. And Mama watch out for his new show. Wow, congrats, baby. We have a new show. Tell them about it. What's Madrasta! It? Yeah. Madrasta. That's the actual title. Okay. See you guys soon. Bye-bye. Thank you.